I hope you guys are hungry. Got my workout out of the way last hour, you know, so it's now time you're gonna to put eat. it all back in. <laughs> right. It's all about the balance flow of life, right, Wes? Mm -hmm. uh, yes. So this morning, the team from Cracked Eggery is cooking with Como. Check it out. I visited their spot. I love today's cooking with Como because I can eat breakfast for every meal. And the Cracked Eggery just opened their Shaw location. So we're in the kitchen right now with AJ. He is one of the co owners. And I love the concept here because all things egg, amazing. Thank you for having us out. Thank you. So tell me a little bit about this spot because you guys started as a food truck back in 2020. That's right. So we started as a food truck on January 1st, 2020. We opened our first shop in Cleveland Park in September. And then we just opened April 1st here. We serve egg sandwiches from 7 to 3 every day. And, and you started some breakfast bowls, and you're expanding yep. because everybody loves the food on the menu so yep. much. So let's make the sandwich that started it all, sure. the classic bacon, yep. egg, and cheese, the, the mare. mare. Yep. Let's Definitely. do it. What all kind right. of bread do we have for this? Uh, so we use a hollow roll from Leon Bakery. Mm -hmm. It's the best bread I've ever, ever had, so it's great. It, it, and bread is so important. It's a staple it for the sandwich. Yep, so it soaks everything up. Put a little oil down. Okay. And you pre-scramble your eggs yep. and there's no filler, no milk, no, no cream, no, no. nothing. Yep. So that is just straight scrambled eggs. That's right. Get it going on the grill. And it's real thin the way you make the eggs. Yep. So it's uh, low, low temperature. We want to cook it slowly. We don't want it to get overcooked or dry out. A little salt and pepper, that's it. And what kind of bacon do you use that makes it special? We use just regular hardwood smoked bacon, no, no applewood smoke or any nice. flavors into Classic. that. So. Then we add our own little twist to it with a little sugar mixture. So and cheese, cheese is important as well. Slice of cheddar, slice of American. Oh, a slice of each. Yep. What kind of sausage would we just throw on there? So we put our, our house made crack sauce on there. It's a mayo mustard based remoulade. So it has it's super tangy. It's not spicy or anything. Goes well on everything. The sandwich is amazing. So that's it. That's it. That's the classic mare that got you all started. That's right. All right. Put in there. Close it up. May I, AJ? There thank you. Enjoy. Uh, let's head out to the dining room and get with Mike because we have a whole bunch of menu items prepared that we get to eat. I've been waiting so patiently to try the mare, the original sandwich that got the cracked eggery started. Mike, are you ready? I'm ready. Oh my god. That cracked sauce is so good. It is. It really complements the sandwich well. It's tangy, but not spicy. Mm -hmm. I would crave this and come back for more. Yes, that's the whole goal. Yes, okay. The sweet heat on the bacon really makes it. I'm gonna hold this and grab a garlic parmesan yes. tot. And then tell me about the other two sandwiches you have. So here we have the Pauli Cicero. Mm. You know, we tried to have a lot of fun with all mm. the names, but the Pauli is prosciutto, ricotta, sun-dried tomato, pesto, arugula, and a little bit of our garlic parm shake that's also on the tots, which are the best-selling tots we have You're by speaking far. my language. Yes. I see why. And this sandwich right here. So that is the Southern Charm. That started as a BLT. And what's better than a red tomato but a green one that's fried? So mm. we made our own pimento cheese in-house. Uh, we added the same cracked bacon from the mayor, lemon aioli, and some arugula. This was a special request. I looked at the menu and he said, do you have any special requests? I love buffalo chicken everything. So this is a bowl of tots, cheese, buffalo chicken and egg. What yep. else do we have in there? Scallions? Uh, some scallions, yes. So that's, uh, we launched this a couple months <gasps> ago. It's been uh, doing very well. Oh uh, my God. Yeah. The chicken's phenomenal. The tots really work well and you know, the egg ties it all together. But we make the buffalo sauce in house and it's great. Just let's wrap it up with something sweet. We take our challah bread, slice it, simple dredge, fry them in the fryer, and they come with syrup, and then everyone adds the honey butter on the side, too. Just perfection. As a breakfast expert, I like to mm -hmm. call myself unofficial. I am blown away by the taste of this food. Thank you for having us out to the Cracked Eggery location. Thanks I see why you have such a huge following. Thank you. And I think I have something that might make everybody back in the studio a little happy. Maybe your bellies will be as happy as mine. <laughs> oh, I don't know what to do. Uh -oh. I want to hold the sandwich and eat that bowl. So Keep going. we'll end on a bite of the crispiest, most delicious bacon sandwich ever. <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> oh my goodness. So Cracked Eggery, that was their Shaw location. They also have one in Cleveland Park. And they started as a food truck and got this huge following. So I had to bring the sandwiches back for everyone to try. I finished the entire sandwich in half that top bowl when I was out there. Mm. So Claire and Marissa, guys got the classic. Mm. What do you think? You really like it? So good. Mm, good. Like you said, the sauce. Mm-hmm. It's not spicy, but it has a kick to it. It has a little bit of a kick to it. So I've they, never had an egg sandwich with sauce on it. And I really like it. It's like spicy sweet. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I can taste the hickory. And that bread hits different. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's good. And then we also have this one with the um, fried green tomato on top that I gave Claire half of to try. So yep. the crew can be happy as well. I really enjoyed it. So I wanted to make sure everybody here got a little Friday taste. Thank you, Erin. Mm -hmm. Two thumbs up. Mm.